The bouncing yellow exclamation point can only mean we are where a quest is starting. But I should tell you that on the end of the last one, as I rolled in here, I shot a zombie with this shotgun right here, killed the zombie, and it didn't do anything for the marksman quest. So that's why we are now holding this shotgun, and I'm pretty much just coming through looking strictly for zombies to shoot. That is pretty much the only thing going on here. Although, I suppose I should put this guy down here. We should probably drill this stuff out too, because wow, this is good. We're going to have all sorts of crap ready back at the base once we return. Um, that one. Actually, here, you know what? Let me just do it that way. I feel better about this. Really? Uh, do you count as a zombie? I don't know, I didn't pay attention. I mean, technically it's a zombified dog. But I don't know if it counts. Hello, hello, hello. Check that out, we have officers of the law. Yep, dogs do count, by the way, in case you were wondering. Okay, let's put a couple more shells in there. Not necessarily looking to do the big super duper double loot thing. I mean, I guess we're probably going to realistically here, but again, I'm just really looking to get some zombie kills. I mean, technically, we would get there eventually, but, eh, you know, sometimes it doesn't hurt to, to help out a little bit and just push things along. Okay, you're faking over there. So let's ask you to stop faking. Hi, kitty. Is there anyone in here? It's one of those hiding places. Ooh, a beaker! Oh, that's good stuff right there. I'm not even joking. Super excited about that. And I do like this basement because it has a crap ton of materials. I may or may not have remembered that and decided that it's worth it to go into the basement and do all this stuff just for the materials. I'll leave that to you to decide. I don't even know how many times I've been through this POI. At least once, I'll tell you that much. Okay. Wow. That was a straight-up good rifle there. And that's not even a bad knife. And I think that was a, <laughs> a good baseball bat. Wowzers. Holy crap, this place was just beautiful. I forget where this comes up at, though. It does come up at, like, a broken tree or something. I think maybe this one's under the... Hmm. Maybe that one's under the porch. I kind of get my... My exits mixed me, mixed up, easy for me to say, on some of these buildings. Especially if I haven't been through them in a little while. It's like, wait a minute, which one is that? Oh, we should probably be checking these here. I'll just do this super quickly. Not even paying attention to what's in there. Oh, this is so much better than using a pickaxe. Okay, good enough. We don't have to get everyone because... We're not... Um, hi. You're kind of in the way. I didn't want to be in stealth, but thanks. I said I didn't want to be in stealth. My cat's still uh, hanging out on my keyboard. Or, wait a minute, let me do this. My cat seems to be near my keyboard again. It's the strangest thing. No, I'm not recording this episode and the previous one back to back. Why would you say such things? Probably didn't need to backtrack this way, but oh well. It's too late. I've already done it. No take backs. Okay, back in we go. Just like that. Level 103. Ooh, there was a bandolier mod in there. Hold on. Hold on. For one more day. Oh man, 
we're going to have a good little chunk of parts by the time we're done here. Band... Oh, Lear. We already have the bandolier. Okay, no, that wasn't even a bandolier. It was... Never mind. We already have one. None of these things matter. I'm just going to eat that because those things don't seem to do anything anyway. Whatever. I may be wrong, but they don't seem like they do anything, so I don't really care about them. Okay, this guy is all locked and loaded. Once again, I'm destroying blocks with my shotty gun. And we'll head through the house decent away. Corpses, corpses everywhere. Corpses, corpses, I don't care. Nope. You're not dead. You're faking. Or re-dead. I don't know. Does this work? Nope. I was trying to see if I get brass out of that. So shotgun does not work for getting brass. So noted. Okay. I'm really just looking to rip through here and get rid of zombies ASAP. Not looking to spend a lot of time in this. And we've been in here. We've been in here. Okay, so... And we should be able to come through this way. How you doing? Hey, look at that. We got a new recipe. Goldenrod tea. That used to be such a thing in this game. And I don't know that it is anymore. I mean, I, it's... It's literally still in the game. That's not my point. I just mean, I don't know that it matters like it used to. I don't know that any of that food watery stuff does, for that matter. Corn on the cob recipe, it looks like. Hmm. Toilet knife. Been a while. Okay, we'll reload this guy. Get ready for some more... Where is everyone? Okay. We'll just backtrack in a minute and find them. They gotta be somewhere. Wow! Ah, oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I don't even care that that's a farm crate. Or that it's a shamway crate. I mean, I guess food crate would have been even worse, but I don't even care. Ah, oh, that was good stuff. I don't think I care about those things. Um, wow. And a magnum in there. Okay. Let's process some of these items. And when I say process, I generally mean scrap, read, eat. Okay, just like that, we're down to two instead of nine blocks holding us down. And then we can go ahead and grab all these things. Clearly, with the Portland concrete, just kind of thinking back to uh, the last one here. Oops, and I grabbed the die. Didn't need to do that. We are going to need a bunch of rocks. Now, generally, you need a bunch of rocks when you're making concrete anyway, because you got to have rocks plus the sand to have the concrete. But just the same, we are going to need more than I was anticipating, because... Now we have to make the Portland concrete. Not a big deal, just an observation that things will indeed be slightly different and that we need to be prepared for that. I don't know where we are on the marksman quest. Let me take a look at that guy. 24 out of 25. We are still not done in here. There's still a zombie somewhere. I don't know where. Oh no, we are done. Return to trader. Okay, got it. Um, can I just leave this way, maybe? No. I was hoping this would be faster. I don't know which side the truck is on. This one. Nope, truck is over here. That's the back. I left the truck at the front. Ten stones. Never know when you need them. Well, we need all of them, so never mind. Okay, let me put this junk away. We're going to just... Scrap the sickle, because that doesn't matter. 
bunch of this stuff we'll just keep because it does matter, like the beaker. I mean, my gosh, I've already forgotten about the beaker, and I was excited about the beaker. We have found so much stuff. It is just ridiculous. Like, good, genuine... I wasn't even wearing the right goggles for that. Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow. Ow. I'm gonna scrap that guy. We'll just get some parts back for it. That's fine. We're not using that. I think we got more... No. I see, I think we got more parts than we used, but I don't think that's true. Combat knife. Um, here, we'll put these guys in here. And we might... Hmm. Okay, that one's not better than what we have already. I was just checking that out. That's pretty good right there. We'll probably just roll shotgun for a little while, just for giggles. Kind of curious to see what's over here. I might poke my head down this path just... Just long enough to see what's down here, but we'll go turn this quest into the trader and we'll get rid of some stuff. I'm just kind of interested in maybe moving that along so we can get a tier three quest now. Just been kind of thinking about that, moving up to the higher tier quests. I mean, if nothing else, I'm really excited by some of the stuff we found today. Much better weapons. I mean, we're just... I'm feeling pretty good about where we're at. Even though it's day 19 and we don't have a plan for day 21. I'm curious if this is going to turn the corner there. I suspect it will. There was a building up there on that hill. Well, shoot, maybe not. No, this one's not going to turn the corner. Where are you going to then? Unless you're turning the corner way out here. In which case, that's just crazy talk. No, you're not going to. I can tell you're going to snake back to the left. Oh, you're just going to end. Those are my favorite. When you're following a path, that literally goes to nothing. It's cool. I mean, some of them probably should go to nothing just to keep you on your toes. That way you don't always expect that there's something there. But, you know, sometimes it's just frustrating. So let's cut over to this path, which probably is a mistake, but I don't think it'll be that big a deal. And we'll see what's on this side here. Because it looked like there were some interesting buildings that, at least the one up here, at a distance, I didn't recognize it. Looks like it's a little gas station. Well, you know me, I like gas stations. And I think we still need to kill one more zombie. Wow, we loot so fast now. It's just ridiculous. Hi. Okay. So Marksman is done. I'm walking on air, apparently. Or on hair. Take a pick. Wow! Oh man, this is dead just... Let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Man. I am just, like, beside myself with glee right now. This is, ah, oh, this is just excellent. I mean, come on. What is not to like about all this? Oh, you want to drop stuff too? What do you got? 237 buckaroonies. Excellent. Uh, can we get back? Technically, this will take us back to town, I suspect. But here, let's just go ahead and cross back to the other path, because I want to go to the trader and... I don't know, maybe we have a couple of things we can sell with what we 
have in our inventory right now. Aside from, like, the kids' toys. Well, I guess they could be adult toys. Although that starts to take on... Never mind. Let's just go back to the trade room. Alright, we have some stuff in the bike here that we can sell. Kind of tempted to get rid of that guy just because, but I won't. So here, let's just go ahead and repair the things that we shall sell. Scrap iron pickaxe. I'm just going to scrap that guy. I don't know if these are worth selling. Doesn't look like they're worth much. I'll go ahead and repair it anyway and repair you anyway and... I don't know, whatever. Just repair some of these things. It doesn't matter. I'm going to put that guy away because I don't want to accidentally sell that. I don't think I will, but gosh, you never know. You, What's up, buddy? So we could get... In your debt. Let's get some you ammunition from you. Oh, that's right. We get two things now. Oh, you know what? I'll take a water purifier mod. It's fine. That might seem like an odd choice, but it's all right. I don't mind it. Northwest or southeast or just straight east? Interesting decisions. Let's go northwest. It's an Aussie village. I forget what that one is. I might not know what that one is now that I say that. Never mind. So that guy we will use. We're going to keep that. Probably should be keeping some of these things I'm selling, but... I don't know if we have a bunch of those, so I'm going to hold off selling that. There we go. So the rest of that stuff we're pretty much good on. We're fine. Let's do the old quick tour through here to see what you have. I'm not seeing a whole lot of interest right now. Although, it wouldn't be a bad idea necessarily to buy a bunch of darts. Just kind of thinking out loud. I'd like to get... Uh, sure, we're going to buy that. I think I might just start buying any mods I can find, just in principle here, because... Uh, let me rephrase that. Buy any firearm mods I can find, just because we really do need a lot of them. Electrician and Cook will buy those. Oh, wow, look at how much that auger costs. Just out of curiosity. Wow, we don't really get much for that guy. That's doing... 37 block damage and 418. That's a little slower. And the same block damage. That's maybe not such a great deal after all. Hmm. Wasn't really expecting that. I'm not going to buy that one just because the, the semi and the auto not as big a fan of. We didn't bring a bunch of money with us, so we cannot afford to get some of those guys. Hunter's Journal. Art of Mining. Um, sure, we'll do that. We'll just buy these. Again, I'm just really looking at completing books more than anything else. I'm not super concerned about doing more damage to humans because, you know, there are no other humans playing, and sometimes it's debatable whether there's a human playing this one, but whatever. Oh, I was supposed to sell that. Here. Let me do this. Here, let's take you off. Modify you. Put that on there. Call it good. Repair it. You should automatically wear it again. Because Alpha 18 I think changed that to be like that. One of them did. I don't know. And it's nice. I like it a lot. It's one of those little quality of life things that I just just appreciate. And I probably don't say it enough. So devs, well done on that. Like, straight up, well done. Okay, we cannot put that guy in there. I had a feeling that was the case. It's fine. But we can put that in the AK. I know that much. We can also put it in the M60, which... <laughs> but whatever. Not worrying about that here. Put that junk away. Let us go. Where are we going to go now? Do we want to go knock out that quest? I'm kind of saying yes to that, because I want to see what's to the west. Let's go check that out. Looks like this is going to open up into another township, which... Never mind the crappy driving. I was kind of doing some driving and looking at other stuff as I was going. But I see a lot of 
different stuff here, inclusive of, it looks like, a couple of these big uh, gas stations that have tons of boxes in them. I guess we really need to talk about getting a chainsaw going now, because I'm really, really enjoying how quickly the auger plows through things. And it'd probably be a good idea to get a chainsaw set up so we could do the same thing. So this is, I'm guessing, the Tier 3 location. Hello? This is considered an Aussie village, apparently. Oh, I just now noticed. Ah, uh, dang it. You weren't supposed to be there, because you were supposed to be sold. Um... Pretty sure we ignore landmines. So... What's in here? Just out of curiosity. Stop faking! Okay, thank you. If this whole thing is... Is everything locked in here? I mean... It kind of makes sense in a way. Okay. Oh, hi, madam. I'm trying not to use anything but the baseball bat right now, but I'm really going to be struggling with aim, apparently. What's up, sir? Maybe I shouldn't have parked the, the truck right there. Oh! I probably need to be looking into whichever skill gets you stamina back on power swings. Because you're gone, right? You're gone. Let's look into that right now. Is it, um... It's not that one, is it? Killing blows. There we go. Yeah. That's the one. I guess it's not power attacks. It's just killing blows, period. Ooh, there was a, a box in there that we don't have yet. I wonder how much stuff is hidden in the floor here. I'm curious now. Okay, there are a couple of books we didn't have right there. That's exciting. So I'm guessing you're supposed to come in from up top. Well, that's just where we jumped in, so never mind that. Just because then you can come in that way, but whatever. Wow, more books we don't have. I didn't mean to grab paper, but whatever. I'll just take all that. I think that was yet another book we didn't have. I'm going to take all these things. The sooner we can get through 25 zombies with a baseball bat, the sooner we can go back to using more efficient weapons. I think this might be a wandering horde, if I'm not mistaken. Ow, now I'm on fire, and I'm bleeding. No, I'm just on fire. Okay. Yeah, this is a wandering horde. Oh, come on, man. Stop ducking. It's not okay. Ooh, that was a good shot right there. You need to be done. I mean, I'm taking a lot of swings here. Both uh, giving and receiving. Hey! I mean, we got a bunch of medical supplies here, so I'm not overly concerned about how many shots that's going to take to get rid of this guy, but... Uh, these zombies, alright, I've had enough. I don't know what these guys are, but they're some sort of super bikers. And I don't feel like waiting for how long it's going to take to get through them.
All of you guys are annoying. Okay. Back to whatever it is we were doing, because I've kind of lost track at this point. Are you a regular zombie, or are you a super zombie? Because if you're a super zombie, this is going to be annoying. I mean, I guess I could just put some points in the baseball bat. That's how little I care about spending points wisely. I don't even care. I'm just going to start spending. I don't care. That's the joy of running a modded game. <laughs> hey, you're not done. Where are we at on Fighter Quest? Fighter 20 out of 25, so we're actually really close. What's up? 22. This place is cool, man. Um... I cannot harvest from these. I cannot search them, so... Okay. Just trying to understand what we got going on here. What what are the rules? What are we looking at? Let's check this out. Big water tower. These always make me suspicious. I like when they have water in them and I completely break them. It's my favorite. Then you get water going everywhere. Oh, yeah. You just have water. Nope. Now the water's out. All right, whatever. It's cool. Uh, here, let's just drop down. Nothing to worry about at this point, right? Just drop down. Who cares? Oh, there's some loot in here. How about that? And there's some loot right here, too. How about that? That goes pretty quickly. I'm not displeased with that. Oh my gosh, we gotta stop and read some books here in a minute. Because, hey. Another hidden stash? Excellent. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh. Like, there's literally... So that was Fire Trap Sniper 6. Uh, do more damage against armored opponents. Bartering with a Magnum gets you a better deal. Schematic for that guy. Less weapon degradation for automatic weapons. Craft cigars. We should probably do that because that'll also give us a discount on trading. Each leg shot, chance to cripple. Uh, military stealth boots. Fully automatic does 1% more damage per hit until you miss. And I think we just finished off that book based on that sound. Okay, we'll do the chicken challenge. And then what else do we have here? I'm going to drop regular bandages because those don't matter right now. And then let's turn you into... We don't have enough cloth. Really? Really? How do we not have enough cloth? That's baffling to me. Okay, whatever. Uh, we got a lot of crap. I... Oh my gosh, we don't even have... We don't have room for all this stuff. This is stupid. This is not a tier 3 place based on the amount of loot we're getting out of it. This is a tier 5. I mean, this is straight up a tier 5. Challenge may not be tier th tier five, but the loot just screams tier five. Challenge, locate trader. Okay, excellent. I'm always on board to find another trader. I think we've pretty much done good work today, and we're not even done with this place. I mean, 
This is redonkulous. Gotta figure out how to load this thing up. How do you compare? That one's better, so... Actually, you know what? Uh, we'll just scrap that guy, and we'll scrap that guy, too. I don't think those parts are gonna stack, but that's fine. Here, let's... Drop all this junk off. This is gonna be stuff to sell. Uh, we need cloth. We don't have any cloth. That's... Fascinating to me. I suppose we could make some. It's not that hard to make some cloth, but... It's not really super necessary, either. I'm just... Kinda... Kinda spitballing here, like, wow. We don't have any. I'll put the paper in there for the time being. We're probably not going to keep that, so don't get excited by that. If you think, hey, KIC's finally turned the corner and he's going to keep paper now, probably not. The more I see, the more I believe there's not going to be a need to do that. I really do think we're going to be just fine on ammunition without paper. I could be wrong, but we'll find out. I don't know what else we need paper for. I just have to check recipes, and then we would know, but whatever. So we're not even done in here. Apparently we're going a little long today, because I still want to, you know, loot this place. We've already looked at what was in there. I, I already forgot, so I'm not going to concern myself greatly with figuring that out. Okay, I was kind of hoping to find a way in. I guess that one will do. Hmm, that went in the wrong spot, because I don't know if there's anything under that one. Well, simple solution is get rid of the box, and then you can find out. Nope, there is not. Okay, good. not paying attention to what these vehicle parts are, whether they're high quality parts or not, that's going to be something that is going to be probably a priority when we get back to base. I had to guess. I'd really like to get us a new high quality vehicle. I think that would be a really, really good idea. Kill the wabbit! Kill the wabbit! I hope this isn't another of those exact same hordes, because they were annoying. I like how the lighting just changed right there. Are you done? Nope. Are you done? I'm gonna say you are done. Hey, fighter's done. I can stop using that and use something that'll actually kill zombies quickly now. Excellent. I don't know, I'm just reading these things, I don't care. Even if we shouldn't be reading them over here, whatever, doesn't matter. It's fine. Scrap iron pickaxe, we can get rid of that. Wooden bow schematic, don't care. So that's a regular mini bike. that is a regular motorcycle, so... Not anything interesting out of those. That's totally okay. So we've gone through there. We have more or less, I'm going to say, gone through that one. Got a lot of chairs here. I saw this green out of the corner of my eye and I thought, Oh crap, there's some green zombies over. Oh, never mind. It's just melons. Got it. The hilarious part about all this to me is we're not even done here. I mean, we're not even done. Like, it's just, it's just outrageous. Really? Those are not very hidden.
Oh yeah, I don't have to use that anymore. I forgot. Anyone else? Wow. Oh, and you dropped loot. That's not a bad knife. I've been waiting to get a, a good, high-quality knife. That... Wow. That might be it. I'm not... I'm not sure. I'm curious, too. Okay, now you just connect through here normally. I, I thought maybe there might be some shenanigans afoot somewhere. That uh, maybe somehow this stuff... Like there's some hidden blocks in here or something. Not the case. So have we gone through everything now? Did we go through this? I don't think we went through in either of these guys. Alright, just, just go away. Okay. I recognize I left a couple other things behind, some trash and mailboxes and whatever. Not going to sweat that stuff right now, because the real problem is going to be figuring out how to leave with all this crap. I mean, okay, boom. There's all of our stuff that we already have done. Going to scrap those guys. Scrap that. I'll even... I kind of want to scrap it, but I'm kind of hesitant, too. I mean, I guess we can get rid of all these stuffed toys and all of these books. I mean, they don't sell for a lot, but man, when you have a bunch of them, they add up super quickly. So, I just, I don't know. I mean, here, we can get rid of those guys. We can scrap that, because those things we can always make. Here, let's take this guy out and... That guy. We're going to modify you and just put that in there. That'll instantly save a single slot, which, you know, it may end up being that we need, like, one slot is the difference between us um, taking something back and not. I don't know. I'm going to guess that the SWAT helmet's going to be better off than the Kevlar guy here. Yeah. So we'll modify... We'll modify this and put that in there, and that's going to make itself for a bunch more money. So that's cool. I'm just trying to look here and see, like, what else do we have? What else can we... What else can we sell? I guess we can scrap the lead trophy and the lead stuff there, and then we can free up an inventory slot that way. I don't know if we already have brass. Well, let me switch that out. I was getting tired of listening to the... Because that was kind of annoying. Here, we'll go ahead and pop that guy and we'll eat these and we'll drink these because they don't really matter. We're going to need food and water anyway, so why not, right? And then we're going to scrap the splint because no one cares about it. Blade trap schematic. I was just checking that one. I couldn't remember if it was an actual blade trap or the book, because I can't see the book right now. We got a bunch of junk turrets, which is just spectacular. I've been wanting many more of those. So I guess we can put this stuff away then. The bat here. Let's modify you, and we'll give that guy to the bat. And then we'll put both of these bats on there. It's going to be easy to know which one to sell. It's going to be the one without the mod, which is going to be really confusing to me. Oh, we scrapped it. Never mind. Then it's going to be really easy to me. Don't sell it. Ah, uh, mushroom spores can go away. Really don't care. 
We did get some more cloth fragments, which is handy because we can make a couple of bandages with that. I'm okay with that idea. Kevlar. Oh man, this is just, just absurd. There's no way that we can get through the rest of this POI <sighs> with only the inventory in hand without leaving stuff behind. So we are going to have to leave stuff behind. It's really going to be that simple. Can put that guy back down there. I'm fine with keeping the shotgun for right now. We can leave the pistol as well as the other weapons in there. Uh, nope. There's no room for that. Man. Uh, bottled murky water. No one cares about that anyway. Let's put 25 of those guys in there because chances are we're going to find more pistol ammo. Holy cow, man. That was... That was something else. And this nail gun has no... Interesting. Has no quality to it. I don't know why that is. That just is. Or maybe I should say I don't know why the other one does have quality to it. It just is what it is. I think for right now we're going to call it good, though. We'll check out that place again on the next one as we reset it and try to double loot it, which ought to be interesting. So that's also going to be a fetch quest, so that might turn out to be a little more interesting than I'm otherwise prepared for. Wow. I mean... Just hooking it up today, game. I just don't even know. I'm pretty sure that crossbow is going to be worse than something we already have, because I know we have a five. I just, I don't know here. I'm going to scrap those guys, though. I know it might be kind of silly or seem weird to do that, but I'm okay with it. I'm going to drop some of these things, too. I try to be a little choosier about what we're carrying, because... Some of the stuff doesn't matter. Like, I'm not really going to use Kevlar. So if we can put something else in its place that maybe we'll end up selling, that's that's cool. Because we're going to need to sell some crap. I'm going to call that good right there, though. Go check out patreon.com slash KICgaming. And on the next one, we will reloot this place and do the quest properly because apparently I forgot to do that. Catch you in the next one. Until then, thanks for watching. See you later.